where should the thought of a person should be aimed? The Holy Torah in Parashat Pikudei said to us, וחשב בפעודתו אשר עליו ממנו הוא, etc. כאשר ציווה השם את משה. And Matoka O אומר and teach us that Rabbi Yochanan David Salomon was walking in the Arab market in Yafo and he saw something very unusual. The barber and the shoemaker was sit together on small stools, drinking coffee, and Shmuel speak between them. Automatically, when he came close to them, they were looking in total different areas. The shoemaker looked down, and the barber looked up. After a few minutes, he saw it happen when other people passed. He happed, he understood that each person looked to his own parnasa, his own source of livelihood. The barber looked up to the hair of the person, and the shoemaker looked down for the shoes of the person who's passing. And let's go right now and speak about holiness. They said that Rabbi Menachem Nachum, Mishtefimtesh, Zichon Olevracha, went one day into the Bet Midrash, to his Bet Midrash, and he saw a group of people playing Damka, checkers. They got terrified and so embarrassed that the rabbi caught them doing that in the holy Bet Midrash. And they were shocked that instead of that the rabbi going to rebuke them, he asked them, are you familiar with the law of laws of this game? <laughs> they were so terrified they didn't say a word. The rabbi smiled and said, you are allowed to go one step only, only forward. Sometimes you sacrifice one soldier in order to get two of them and when you come to the peak to the edge you can go any direction no limitation and right in one second he turned this game a futile nonsense game to foundation funda fundamental concepts of service of Hashem and the things is learned from the passage that we said before According to the thought of the person on this world, so will be his dress code to the next world. As it says, V'cheshev efudato, the thought that's going to be his garment, that's going to be upon him. And Kasher tziva Hashem et Moshe. And the Sforno teach us that in every action that they did for the Holy Mishkan, they aim to do the will of Hashem through the words of Moshe. Be'ezat Hashem, we should grasp it and try and utilize it in all our actions and seeing around. We should aim to the will of Hashem, blessed sanctify ourselves and sanctify the environment. Nachat Ruach Klal Yisrael, spread the light of Hashem, Parashat Pikudei.